Now, some of you may not know, but Christina is not actually Merlin's first wife. <laughs> when I was living in California on a temporary work visa, and Merlin was figuring out how he could move to New Zealand, we hatched our own workaround. Merlin, why don't we just get married so I can stay in America and you can move to New Zealand? We were joking, of course, but this started a tradi tradition. While Christina affectionately calls Mer Merlin boyfriend, I call him husband. And while he calls Christina girlfriend, he calls me wife. Can everyone hear me okay down the back? Okay, because now's your chance to move if you can't, because there's no microphone in today's ceremony. I so. make an exit. <laughs> That was enough of an entrance, right? Wow, okay. yeah, okay. yeah, you can do it again. You can do it again. Yeah. You've got a song. I'll we'll make my exit now. Yes. No, but you're coming back. Okay, you're coming back. looks quite different to the one originally planned to be held at the Thayer residence towards the end of 2020. At the time the plans were those plans were made none of us could have imagined the reality that we now face. All of our favorite people still gathered together to celebrate but worlds apart in various different time zones and levels of lockdown. Auntie Michelle, <laughs> I know this day is extra tough for you. When we all get together Together in person again, it's going to be one hell of a party. <laughs> and be assured, I'm going to be giving them extra tight squeezes for you today. May your wedding day in your life be full of love, happiness, joy, peace, and of course, adventure. We wish we could be there, but you know when you get to the States, you always have a room to stay with us. I'm sure you guys are having a blast in New Zealand in your new home homeland. May your stories together have more, you, you know this saying that I love, have more heroes than villains, more adventure than drama, and may love always win. And God bless you. Now marriage means different things to different people. For Christina and Merlin, it's with no desire to be a Mr. and a Mrs. For they feel most at home being boyfriend and girlfriend, and that does not have to change. But it is the opportunity to share their partnership and love with their friends and family. It's putting on paper a commitment to spending their lives together. They're under no illusions that life will be easy, but having each other, they know they have a best friend whose hand they can hold and squeeze when it gets really, really hard. But of course, marriage is also about love. And it's because Christina and Merlin fell in love that we are here today. You're about to make promises to one another that you intend to keep. And Merlin, you can go first. <laughs> oh boy. <clears throat> <laughs> Chrissy, I still find it so difficult to put into words how I feel about you in a way to do those feelings any justice. But the things my love could make me promise you are limitless. So here, before our friends and family, here and abroad, I vow to continue the commitment we have had to that love. Boyfriend, I'm so glad we're only doing this once, technically twice, but then if I'm going through the terror of writing and saying vows, I'm so glad that it's you that I'm standing here doing it with. You are the only person who could make me move across the world without hesitation. And I'm so thankful to have your love, your mind, and your grace. I love you, girlfriend. Can everyone please be upstanding for the bride? undeniably tethered legal version of boyfriend and girlfriend. <laughs> if you so wish, you may give each other a kiss. <laughs> nice. 
now the dinosaur and the lovely other dinosaur are old. Look at them. Together they stand on the hill telling each other stories and feeling the warmth of the sun on their backs. And that, my friend, is how it is with love. Let us all be dinosaurs and lovely other dinosaurs together, for the sun is warm and the world is a beautiful place.